Yo, what's up Airsofters? Welcome back to another video. I'm going to show you how to take off the amplifier or flash hider off the King Arms uh, PDW 9mm SBR. And basically, there are two types of versions. There is the long and then there's the short. So for the people that have the short style of the PDW, it's actually going to be a lot easier. For those that have the long one like me, I'm going to show you how to access to get this off. So basically, if you guys are wondering, I was actually wondering how to take this off myself. I looked all over YouTube how to take this off and I didn't see a single video so I'm gonna make one for you guys so let's actually get started so basically for those that have the long version of the PDW there's gonna be four Allen keys that you have to um, take off or whatever you call them and then basically you want to find the right Allen key for those and take them off I'm not quite sure what size they are you might want to just look around uh, your Allen key set and see which one fits because I'm not good with sizes for Allen keys. So I'll take this off real quick for you guys. All right, so basically once you get it all screwed off, you just pull the two parts of the rail off. And then you have your two, so you have your upper and your lower hand guard. You can set those aside. And then you have your spacer for the, I guess, I don't know what else you'd call it. It's just to help support the hand guard. Don't know too many technical terms of guns right now. <laughs> so basically, now that you have the rail off, or for those that don't have the long one, I think it's easier for you to access it. Um, so basically, what you're going to see is this little hole right here. There's going to be a little pin in there. I forgot what it was called. Um, it's like a little ring pin. I'll put a picture up for you guys right now. And basically, that's going to be in there, stopping it from twisting at all so you want to get that removed and the way to do that is you i'm not going to show it because i already did it and basically what you want to do is take a hair dryer or a heat gun and just heat it up all around this side of the uh the amplifier hold it there for like 10 minutes 15 minutes and it'll heat up the adhesive glue or whatever it is in the threading so you can untwist it and once you get that heated up you'll be able to twist it and it'll uh, and when you do twist it, it'll pop the pin out itself once it's all heated up. So all you would have to do is just twist it just a little bit, and you'll start to see some uh, wiggling within the pin. And basically, you just want to keep twisting it back and forth, and the pin should eventually just come right out, and then you'll be able to freely just untwist it. And once you get it untwisted, here, let me do it for you. This is basically what the threading in the inside is going to look like. It's all adhesive and everything, so you want to heat that up, especially on here. And where that pin's going to be, it sits in a little notch in the threading, is basically how that pin sits in there. Then you have your spacer and your O-ring. So basically, yeah, you might ruin your amplifier a bit if you can't, if you don't have a strong grip, use like... Uh, like vice grips or something uh, just to help you untwist it or something uh, whatever works for you if you, you're already strong as it is you could probably get it off but you know, the main thing is is to heat up that adhesive in there for 10 to 15 minutes and then just twist it back and forth and you'll eventually see the pin pop out of that hole and once you get that pin out um, you should just be able to unthread it with ease, then you'll be able to put your flash hider, uh, like any flash hider or suppressor, tracer unit, anything you want on this gun. So that is basically how you take off the amplifier or flash hider off the King Arms PDW 9mm SBR. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.